so Microsoft has uh, finally released the fix, actual fix, for the problems that were caused by the update. The update that uh, started all of the issues was this particular update, which is right here at the top, which isn't installed on my PC right now. But uh, over here, as of uh, midnight South African time last night, this morning, they released this update, which corrects what this update has been causing for a lot of my customers, and that's that blue screen after printing. Otherwise, the other KB5808, which seems to be causing the computers to just restart when they are printing. So here's the actual, let's just get this open. Here's the actual uh, release from Microsoft where they have uh, marked it as resolved. And the resolution is what uh, they say here is installing this uh, KB5501567 uh, update. So it's rather simple to do that. We just need to go through to start, go through to settings. And from there, we can uh, just check for any, uh, any new updates if it isn't showing already. If it has uh, come up with this optional quality update available, you can then just click on the download and install. Once it's downloaded and installed, you can then uh, restart your PC and you'll be back to normal. If this update isn't showing, what I've noticed with a few PCs today is uh, you need to make sure that all the available updates are installed. Once um, you've installed the latest updates, for example, the, I think it's the Windows 10 version 20H2 or H1, once those have been installed, it'll only come up and show this, this update. So if it's not showing, you may need to just continue to update all of the other things that are outstanding. Once you've done all of that, you'll be able to install this. Okay. Let's just, uh, and I'm going to start with that. It does take a bit of time, um, so I'm not going to have it on the video, but just need to download, install it, wait for it to finish, and restart your PC, and you should be back to normal.